Reagan was actually remarkably successful. Government spending measured as a share of GDP, in other words, the size of government relative to the size of the economy, government was one percentage point of GDP smaller when Reagan left office than when he entered office. Not to mention, if you look specifically at the social welfare state, domestic spending, that fell by 2.5 percentage points. Remarkable. No other president has ever come close. The only other president to actually where we saw less domestic spending in our lifetimes was Bill Clinton. No yeah. other Republican reduced domestic spending relative to, to GDP by even one penny. So Reagan was very successful. And then, of course, I don't give Bill Clinton credit. I actually give it to the Republican Congress, folks like you uh, were being pretty frugal back then in the 1990s. Uh, but Reagan did a good job on spending as much as he wanted to. Of course not. Uh, you know, you never get perfection in Washington. We didn't shut down the Department of Education or anything like that as much as that would have been a good idea. But the most important thing is government spending is always on a trend line. And if you can push that trend line down, especially if you push the trend line down enough that the private sector is growing faster, that's a recipe for fiscal success. In other words, we don't need some sort of, you know, free market, you know, nirvana fantasy land. I, I'm, I might go to sleep and dream about, you know, the, the size of government that our founders had in mind. But heck, victory is simply making sure government grows slower than the private sector. Reagan did that. The problem is the entire 21st century, we've had one big government president after another of both parties. And government has become a much, much bigger burden. And with demographic changes and aging population, the, the things are getting worse, not better. The entitlements are exploding and as, as a fiscal burden. In other words, we're on a path to become another European style welfare state. And it's critically important we have some Republicans, and I'll take anyone, frankly, not just Republicans, but we need lawmakers who are going to say we need to control government spending. Uh, and, and so, in other words, what Reagan set out to do in the early 1980s, it's even more important that we do it today because the problem is even bigger.